come on, we have to go and talk to General Tullys and just explain that this is all a big misunderstanding and you're very, very sorry for shouting that man apart. It'll be simple. I'm sure he's a very reasonable man. He doesn't come across as a very reasonable man, okay? But that doesn't mean he isn't. We've got a very long journey ahead of us, Ulfric. So let's not make it any longer than it has to be. Ulfric, I haven't even got off the bloody bridge yet. Come on. Is this what it's going to take, Ulfric? Do I need to drag you by your arse? Right, I don't know why you prefer this, but this seems to be working a bit better. We have a very long way to go, Ulfric. You can't be causing me all this trouble. All right, I, I, I. I mean, the good thing is I seem to have confused you so much you refuse to move. The bad thing is that you refuse to move. No, 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 no. We have a very long way to go. Right? A very long way to go. The length of the map. And I need you to, yep, puff your chest out and we'll charge on to solitude, but not in the way that you want to charge on to solitude, right? We'll charge on to solitude with open arms and big smiles for everybody. Come on, you dirty fascist bastard. Get over this bridge at least. So guys, just holding hands. Walk it. No, every time I say that, you let go. But listen, don't be weird about it, right? Don't, don't. <laughs> what are you looking at? Yeah. Thinking about it, aren't you? Now, come on. What if I grab you by the tip? Would that make you feel better? Did you think to bring some cake or something? We should have brought like a, a sort of s apology present. Is that a thing people do? I've never had to apologize for starting a civil war, so I wouldn't know. There's definitely something not right. Uh, no, Frick! Stop it! Right, he's dead now, okay? Killed the wolf with your shouting. Although you can do it without saying any words. Is that just a cough? Do you just have like some sort of thumb related chest infection? I've got a bad cough just now, Ulfric. Oh, hey, see? See, we've got something in common. We've got something to talk about on the long journey. You're definitely going to solitude. No, <laughs> every time. I'll grab you by your arse again. You know, after I made that Nazim video, I promised myself I would never do this again. You're like a petulant child. Okay, I am trying to get you to move around rocks. Um, but do you know why that is? That's because I can't turn around because you can't be trusted. That's why that's so that's your fault. Yes, I am victim blaming and I will victim blame all the way to solitude. See if you would get onto the blower, onto the blower at the council and tell them to use the taxpayers' money appropriately and fill in all these potholes. Maybe we wouldn't keep getting stuck in the ground. That's another reason why you should get into this silly war so you can fix the bloody roads. Look at the state of that. There's just not road here. And I'm stuck. Out. There's something not right with me, Ulfric. <laughs> Apart from that, I can't do hills anyway. I, I don't know what disease you have that stopped you from moving, but I'm beginning to catch it. There's a camp. Oh, 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 no, I know you want to rest at the camp, right? I, I kind of want to rest at the camp as well. And if I'd have seen that, I would have probably taken you to the camp because I could be doing with a, a blooming break. But no, we've made too much progress to go backwards, even a little bit. Oh, all freak, mate, come on. We have been on this hill for about 10 minutes. Do something. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, he did something. Yeah, this counts, right? This counts. Make some progress, Alfred. Chase it. That Where the hell is it? Hopefully it's... No, this is backwards. Oh, bollocks. Oh, Alfred, I got all excited. I thought we were running forwards. I thought we were cheating. But in fact, you were running backwards. Oh. Say hello to the nice lady. Maybe. Maybe she could, she could be a wee cow, couldn't she? No, no, let's not. Let's not go and harass and or flirt with a nice lady. Ulfric! Ulfric! Leave the lady alone to her bounty or elk hunting or whatever it is. She, oh my god, I'm going to go insane. Ulfric, I'm actually going to go mental. Did you just want to watch her walk away? Fair enough, but um, now that that's over with, here's your quiche We're going to solitude. Eh. I mean, I say solitude, we'll be lucky to get out of wind helmet this rate. I should be asking you for directions. You should know where you're going. Eh? Hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh, wolf. <laughs> Two seconds, because that says Winterhold, and that's not where we're going. So we don't want to go up here. We want to go this way. You nearly had me going to Winterhold. Is that all you needed, Ulfric? Did you just need a bit of encouragement, eh? Somebody to hold your hand for you to lead the way. I say lead the way. We're both facing the wrong direction. That's how that happens. Come on, do it. Yes, man. Oh, okay, right, um... No, no, this way. No, no, because he's going to run. <laughs> oh, man. This is why there's a war, Ulfric. Right, there we go. The wolf is dead. You shouted the wolf dead. Just like you did High King Torig, which is why we have to go to Solitude and apologise and say it was an accident. And that's going to be a very hard argument to make when you keep shouting all the local wildlife dead. You know what I'll tell you, Ulfric? Um, you're a lot more stubborn than the Zim. 
but you don't run away as much. You know, and you're maybe slightly better company. I don't know, you're both pretty bad. I'll be honest, you're not the best company. Right, you might have to work on that. Right, you might have to work on that if you're going to, you know, if you're going to apologise um, to General Tullius and, and all that mob. You could start by showing them your incredible athleticism. People like that sort of stuff. Oh, we missed a signpost. Well, it's either backwards or forwards and we're not going backwards, are we? No. Mwah. Oh, there's the pub. You don't get to go to the pub. You've been a bad boy. <laughs> bad boys don't get to go to the pub. Bad boys have to go and say sorry. Ulfric, you might think this is somewhat undignified for a Jarl for, you know, somebody who who would who claims to be the High King. But this is the only way I can get you to come with me. So so this is what we do. No, 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 no. Would you believe it? This is beginning to hurt my hand, Ulfric. I'm going to switch hands, okay? Right. Yes, I'm moaning about the damage it's doing to my body. <laughs> that's, that's what's happening here. That's something I'm doing. While you are rotating your head like an owl. You know what I tell you, Ulfric? You know what I'll tell you? This... This is like my favourite part of Skyrim. I love like the pale. Are we in the pale yet? I'm not saying I don't like Windhelm, right? But the pale is like Windhelm, but it's not racist. So it, it's it's better in every conceivable way. Because it doesn't have Windhelm in it. Windhelm. Winterhold. Dawnstar. White run. Riften. None of them say solitude. Um, or even Morthal. I guess we'll follow Dawnstar and hope. No, 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 no. I don't get the point and being a ruler anyway. It looks like a crap job. You just get to sit in a big, ugly, uncomfortable chair and everybody comes up to you with all the problems and you have to make all these big decisions and you don't get to do it. It sounds crap. What was that? Oh, spider. Oh, no. You, oh, sorry. You got covered and got right. My, <laughs> my Ulfric shield will protect me. Oh, right. Good job. I, I suppose one thing you can be proud of is the apparent lack of relative danger on the roads, if you think about it right. I was kind of worried that we would be accosted by bandits and brigands and highwaymen and all that sort of rubbish, but so far, so good. Follow the road. Oh, wh whoa, where are we? Um, uh, right, you know what? Ulfric, I'm going to let you go and do stuff. Show them who Ulfric's Stormcloak is. I'll just have a wee seat. Right, I'm just going <sighs> to... I'm just gonna have a- Ow! Ow! I'm having a seat! You- Ow! Ow! Right, you- You- Nope! 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 Give me a- Alfred! There we go. Me and- Me and you, right? Me and you. We'll, we'll just- We'll just- We'll have a wee seat, right? Oh, that's actually good, because I've been on my feet all day. You, you wouldn't believe how long it's taken. You know, it's probably- Doesn't seem very long to yourself. But, um, it's been- Bloody ages. Now, where did he go? Oh! Stop it! Ulfric! Ulfric! Ah! And a doggo! Oh, I'm being attacked by a dog! <laughs> Where did Ulfric go? Ulfric, I wasn't really prepared to defend myself. Uh, I kind of thought you'd be able to handle all this. Oh, look! Ulfric is traumatised that he killed the dog, so he should be. That's disgraceful, Ulfric. I was going to try and spare the dog somehow. Drop down, attack! <laughs> you, you'll be fine. You look great, right? This this will only show, Ulfric, if you think about it, this only shows General Tullius and all that mob how far you're willing to go to make amends. Do you celebrate like a Guy Fox equivalent in Skyrim? Because you, you could, couldn't you? You could just get the mages to like shoot fireballs into this guy and stuff. That would be quite wild. Why have you got your axe out? What are we being attacked by? Nobody, nothing. Oh, I mean, there's a spider. Don't be mad at me, Ulfric, right? This, this is a laugh. We are, we're bonding, we're having fun. You know, it, it's like it's like the Nazim thing all over again. It's rehabilitation. You know, people people don't particularly like you sometimes because you're, you know, a gullible sort of close-minded arse. Whereas, you know, let, let, let them get to know the real you. Crack a smile, mate. Oh, here's the giants. Do you know you should have giants in your army? And somebody took them from you. Guy by the name of Todd. Never heard of him. You were supposed to have big ants big, big in your army. <laughs> big ants in your army, mate. This has went on far too long. I'm beginning to lose my mind. You were supposed to have big giants in your army, but instead, what did you get? Rail off, rail off, and that racist guy with the bear. Ah! <laughs> Talos, smite you! Smite the wolf! Bad dog. That's a bad dog. Ow! Ah, bit me! Ah, 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 ah! Oh, freak! Oh, freak! Oh, freak! Oh, freak! Oh, freak! Oh, freak! Ah, oh, freak. Oh, freak. Get out! Get out of me! Thank <sighs> you. 
you need to pay more attention. So you are going to face this way. I have to face this way. That way we both have each other's backs. Huh? Huh? Genius. Ulfric, don't look at him, right? Don't look at him. You just run, pal. Just run. I won't tell him. That was definitely not some sort of dark elf fugitive. Why do I feel like we're going to Dawnstar? Is that because this is the road to Dawnstar? <laughs> Ulfric, this is the road to Dawnstar. We've been going the wrong way for a little bit. Um, Maybe it's not the wrong way after all. Because I'm sure there's like a road that way. And maybe we'll get lucky and maybe it'll take us to Morthal. Because if we can find Morthal... We can find Solitude. If we can find Solitude, we can find General Tullius. And if we can find General Tullius, you can say you're sorry. For shouting the skin off of High King Torig or whatever it was you did. A warmongering, treacherous bellend. That's, that is, that's, that's what they're saying. We want, to, we want to fix that rep. Yeah, you don't like the sound of that, do you? We want to fix that reputation, so we do, Ulfric. And we start by going up to Big General Tullius and saying... Listen, Biggie, what happened, happened, right? Nothing we can do about it. There's no point in all this back and forth getting everybody involved. Let's put an end to it, right? Bygones be bygones. That's, that's what they say. Let's let bygones be bygones. And you shake each other's hand. And then that's it, you know? And if he has a wee comment, you know, you've you just got to kind of take that one on the chin, pal. He gets to do that. You did start a civil war. And if he wants to call you a racist war merchant, then, you know, he gets to do that. He'd also be right, wouldn't he? Yes, he would. Right, come on. I actually think we're going the right way. Oh, there are more wolves. <laughs> I, I was going to grab that one, but I guess not. See, I'll be honest, right, I could help, but I can't be bothered. By the time I pull my weapon out, you've already dealt with the trouble, haven't you? You're Jarl Ulfric. To try and help you would be insulting. You yeah, I need my help, you're Jarl Ulfric. Now, come on. I don't, I don't really know what's going on here, Ulfric. I'll be honest. Right, I'll be honest, but I, I'm, I'm tired of... I'm tired of trying to do anything, come on. I don't even know what you're moaning about. It's only been an entire day. <laughs> it's only taken us... And it was, you know, it was eight in the morning. Eight in the morning, right, wolves. You do that, right? It was eight in the morning when we left Windhelm. It is not my fault. It has taken us all this time just to get to... Just to get to wherever we are. And if you would like to drag somebody all across Skyrim, you're looking at the Plank mod. P-L-A-N-C-K. But one of the older versions, I think this is version 2 point something, because the latest versions you can't... You know, they're much more immersive than this. People get mad when you grab them. You can't just drag them everywhere because obviously you can't. But um, the earlier iterations kind of just let you physically abuse folk, which isn't something I would promote. I, I don't mean, I'm not... I, you know what? This is a mod for deviants. Ah, there's a detox and a carriage and maybe people. We can't help the people offer it. He's like, but we can. I must help the people of Skyrim. Well, we can't because we have to go to Solitude. Okay. And because I think they're dead. We'll just leave them alone. No, we won't. You'll have to fight them. I'll fight as well. Oh, frick me. Come on. Whoa. Right, hold on. Hold on. Oh, hen, cover yourself up. A wee bit of decency. It's a family-friendly channel, this. <laughs> Cracker of a night, though, isn't it? Huh? The moon, one of them, at least. A big laser in the sky. Can he beat it? <laughs> Listen, right, my hands are getting... I've had my arms up holding you for about two hours now, and now I'm just putting them at my side. So this is what you get, right? This is what you get. You're just going to have to work those calf muscles, buddy. Stop puffing your chest out like a big man. You can't be doing that when you meet the general. You have to be a bit more humble. Nobody likes a wido. That's what, that's what we call you where I'm from, a wido. Spider. A dead rabbit! Sorry, Jarl Ulfric, you, you probably think this is quite undignified for a Jarl to have a rabbit's arse shoved in their face. But to your credit, right? Listen, rabbits keep their arses very clean. It probably doesn't even have any poo on it. To your credit, we never found any dead rabbits on the roads to Windhelm, did we? No, we didn't. Yeah, I tell you what, eh, you, wouldn't have, you wouldn't have allowed that, would you? And oh, there's a dead fox as well. What the hell is going on in this place? You might have the right of it, Ulfric. Do you know that? I'm not sure this General Tullius can be trusted. I mean, you know, slaughtering your fellow kinsmen and stuff is one thing. A wee cute rabbit and a wee cute fox. All right, hand over your valuables. 
or I would gut you like a fish. He doesn't know you're Ulfric Stormcloak. He can't see you because you're not. He doesn't know anything. So there's no possible way a man like Ulfric Stormcloak would be a man hand would would allow himself to be manhandled by this wee Scottish guy. But that's Ulfric. Oh. Oh, I can't believe it, Ulfric's not even going to help. Ulfric's not even going to help. Ulfric's not going to help his best pal. I can't believe you didn't help me, Ulfric. Shocking, so it was. Think about all the times I helped you that once with the spiders, maybe, in, a, in the fort. I did, I helped to the fort eventually. Right, once you realised you weren't going to do it all yourself. <laughs> I, I did, I, rushed, I jumped to your aid. I jumped to your aid after having a seat, right, in a, in a sandwich with that guy. But up after that, I helped. Oh, Ulfric. Ah, Ulfric! You know what I said? We have to go to Morthal, because through Morthal we'll somehow get to Solitude. We can just skip Morthal. There's greenery. I mean, it's brown, right, because it's Skyrim, and Skyrim's a bloody, ugly, miserable place. That means we've skipped Morthal, and we're either going wildly in the wrong direction, or we're on the last stretch to Solitude. The last stretch to you reclaiming your name as a good guy. The last stretch to me finally getting this bloody thing done so I can sit down because my feet are killing me. Yes, I will complain about how sore I am. What's going on with my hand? Ah, it started to rain. Oh, frick. <laughs> Mate, I'll blame you for the weather if I want, right? I get to do that. I've spent the entire video violating you. Why not blame you for the rain as well? Was that lightning I heard? They're skeletons. Say hello to the skeletons and the necromancer. And the lightning. Ulfric. There she is. Solitude. The great city of Solitude, the Blue Palace. Where you well, you're not gonna to go to the Blue Palace, you're gonna to go to General Tullius. Because the lassie doesn't seem to have much to do with the whole thing. We're we're gonna to go to, to the big man. The big man who's got a plan, who's playing the long game. Unlike you with a short game. <laughs> the, the, the wee, the wee. There you go, wee, a wee short game. Oh, oh, a wee short game. So you do, it's just a wee game. Just a wee one. A wee, just a, a wee, a wee short. Winky. Talking about you. No, no, no. Don't you get funky now that we're, we're in the last stretch. Ulfric, I've just picked you up by your ass and I'm now carrying you with one hand. Who's the real high king here? Huh? What the hell is going on? If I'd have known, I could have done this ages ago. Just pick you up and take you with me. Oh, this is way... Okay, I mean, now, I can, now I'm kind of looking... Okay, it's all kind of falling apart now because I can see through you. But I tell you what it also is. It's also significantly bloody easier. Eh, hey, you ever want to see what Ulfric's got under that storm cloak? Um, it's nothing, really. Will the Imperials be mad that you're here? This might come as a surprise. I haven't super thought this through. I just, I thought it would be funny. I figured it would be relatively painful and it has been for me, yourself, and probably the audience. But I didn't really, I didn't really, th I thought, right, right okay, listen. I, I figured you, you go through Morthal, maybe we, we end up in Solitude, da da da. That's Dragon Bridge, right? That's Dragon Bridge. Are they going to be mad if I try and drag you through Dragon Bridge? <laughs> Dra drag you through Dragon Bridge. I'll need to drag your corpse body through it. Um, only one way to find out, I suppose. Have I finally gotten through to you, Ulfric? Have you decided to take charge and march to Solitude and apologise? on your own, by your own accord, on your own two feet, without me having to, you know, degradingly drag you there, bent in half, bent over. You did then immediately get pushed around by a butterfly! <laughs> ah well, there goes whatever dignity you thought you'd regained, Ulfric. No, 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 there's no point now, pal. Because I'm going to tell everybody the, the butterfly story. I'm trying to work out where you're going, right? Because this this has actually kind of confused me because there's no real obvious path here, I don't think, that would take you... Uh, you would think you would go you would go that way where the, the roads to Windhelm eventually lead, but no. You want to go through Dragonbridge. Is this you saying, General Tullius, I will walk through fire and all your men just to say sorry about the whole Civil War thing? Or is it because you know that there's a Stormcloak camp over there, I think? and you're just going to go and sit with your pals and have a pint because you think you've earned it, because you think you've done something. I'm the one that's had to work for it. I'm knackered. Arms are sore, fingers are sore, feet are sore, standing in the same spot. I mean, um, <clears throat> walking, obviously, miles across Skyrim or whatever. My back's kind of sore. <laughs> Ulfric, you don't know what a quick save is, right? But I've just plop plopped one down because I'm not entirely sure what you're doing or how this is going to go. Right, there's that guy, right? Maybe maybe he'll be chill. Right, there's a guy chopping wood, but he's just a, a wood chopping chop wooder guy. Please understand... 
He's very sorry. He's very sorry about the whole war thing. He, he, he told me personally. Very sorry that he shouted at the man and that the man died, coincidentally. Accidentally on purpose. Now, I can't help you here, old friend. Imagine me even trying to offer help. I can't help you, right? Because see, if I attack them, then they'll aggro me and then they'll constantly want to fight. Right? This is a you problem. I mean, it's kind of his problem as well. And somewhat his problem. <laughs> so how's that apology going, Ulfric? <laughs> you, you, are you working on it? <laughs> no, right. L l listen. Right, you come here. Time on a tradition of the duel. Huh? And we, we respect the traditions here. Oh my god, I'm beginning to sound like Ulfric. Because <laughs> the whole time on a tradition of one-on-one -on -one combat and then he shouts at somebody and then they die. That's kind of how all this happened in the first place, wasn't it? Are you happy now? You've had your slaughter. I was curious to see where you were... Should be fun. No! <sighs> Ulfric, I was just... I'm just... I'm just trying to help... I'm just trying to help you, pal! No, 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 he's very angry! I mean, this is certainly one way to get him to solitude. Oh, dearie me. Ulfric doesn't seem in a very apologetic mood. I can see solitude. We can see solitude. We're doing this together, Ulfric! He's a madman. No wonder General Tullius wants to cut his head off. I should never have modded you to have a one second cooldown on your shouts. That was a terrible oh, no. See all this flagrant use of your shout? This is the problem in the first place. If you'd be more responsible and you didn't use it all the time, you didn't just kill everybody all the time, Ulfric. Maybe, maybe none of this would have happened. The realm would be at peace. The Thalmor wouldn't be gaining the upper hand. No, they wouldn't. Instead, here we are. You should run away. Surely he's not stupid enough to follow me into solitude. <sighs> oh no, oh no, okay, okay. Ulfric, mate, what are you doing? Come on, this is no way to... Oh wow, he's a madman. He's lost his mind, so he has. You you keep him busy. I'll go get General Tullius. General Tullius, General Tullius has to know. General Tullius has to know. No! No, no, no! Why are you all mad at me? Ah! No, 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 no! General Tullius! General Tullius! No! I just wanted to... I just wanted to put an end to the Civil War. Please, you have to believe me. I just wanted to put an end to the Civil War. And, and just... And it would be better and it would all be red. Wouldn't it be nice if it was all red? Not me. That. The t no! Stop it! You, you, General T... Uh, uh, mate, mate, this is just, just a huge misunderstanding. I just wanted to put an end to the war. Um, how did you even get in here? I'm a man of peace. I'm a man of peace. This was supposed to be a mission of peace. I didn't go through all of that. Stop it, 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 stop it. I brought you your Ulfric and this is the thanks I get. Hey, look, you're welcome. I'll grab you by the foot. I'll grab you by the foot, so I will. I'll grab you. I'll, gra I'll kill you all. I'll kill you all with my mace. I've got a mace somewhere up. I can't see. Ulfric. 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 <sighs> Not even a thank you.